Oprah's getting wiggy with it. I'm Kelty Colleen, and this is your OMG Insider Update. Come on, come on. Oprah Winfrey's career is larger than life, and now so is her hairdo. The media mogul rocked a giant Afro wig on the cover of O, the Oprah Magazine September issue, and the queen of TV is all hair. Dubbed Wild Thang by Miss O, the wig weighed a whopping 3.5 pounds, and once Oprah slipped on the sky-high dew, everyone had something to say about it. The TV host bestie Gail King thought the wig was hilarious, likening her fro to the king of the jungle, teasing, can someone put on the soundtrack to The Lion King? And O's creative director, Adam Glasman, compared her new look to a combination of Shaka Khan and Diana Ross. But after Oprah put away the wig, she went for a less dramatic look inside the mag, posing with her own natural, untouched hair. She wrote, no wig, weave, perm, braids, twists, extensions, curling iron, straightening comb, or blow dryer. Au natural. OMG Insider co-anchor Kevin Frazier sat down with Queen Oprah Monday, and she was still really excited about her wig. Check this out. And let me confess, this is not my hair on the cover. Okay. It belongs to Kim Kimball, who is wig maker extraordinaire, and I know she's done Beyonce's hair and other people's hair, and she now like does hair and has hair and sells hair. So that is 3.5 pounds of hair on my head. So literally, when we put it on, my hair went <laughs> like that. All hail Queen O, Queen O, Queen O. I love Oprah, but I want to hear from you. What look are you liking more, Oprah au natural or Oprah the lioness? Let me know on Twitter. I'm at Kelsey Colleen. Use our hashtag OMG Insider and be sure to tune in to OMG Insider on television tonight. Bye, guys.